Hey everybody, The Legend Mac here with my good friend Boris and we're here to discuss a topic, a really interesting topic in the One Piece community and it comes with the main character of the series, Monkey D. Luffy and his growth and his development and the thing is, it's a lot of people like to say that Monkey D. Luffy, his development is among other shonen main characters is really bad yo a lot of people like to say he hasn't really developed yo he's still the same old guy since the beginning yo and we're really today we're just going to discuss on what we think his growth has been yo since the beginning yo since the beginning when he sailed off when he was 17 years old until now he's a 19 year old man who's doing big things in the new world and i, I want to hear your thoughts on this boris yeah so luffy's uh you know for a series that's gone on for this long you know one piece is one of the longest running animes in shonen or manga whatever you want to call it you know, a, there has to have been some sort of obvious development with Luffy. Now, how extreme was that? How drastic has it been? Uh, to be honest, I don't think it, he has changed that much. I really don't yes. think he's changed that much. Or, I, you know, Oda hasn't made him change that much. Um, and like, with you, with, with you said there, he hasn't changed. But I always have to say that Luffy doesn't really need to change so much because his character at first was a really likable character. Like, his character was at first what made him stand out, like, the way he is, you know, so... If Luffy changed, I would be off-putted by that. I'll, I'll be a little scared if he changed, though. But continue. No, yeah, you're, you're right. Yeah, definitely. Uh, it's it's sort of like that that carefree nature and yes. that, that that really drive to find freedom, the ultimate freedom, is is really what defines him. And that's really what attracts people to the, the character of Luffy. I mean, who doesn't want to be the freest man in the world? Who doesn't want to be able to just do whatever they please? Uh, mm -hmm. that, that, that concept of just... Being able to do whatever you want is is I think it magnetizes it's like it, it attracts people to to the character of Luffy. Now, yeah, but when it comes to his personality and stuff like that, his his you know what he tends to do during yes, a normal the, arc, the, the recklessness. Yeah, that <laughs> hasn't really changed too much. Uh, and he has gone through some stuff. Uh, he definitely has gone through some stuff. And I definitely think uh, that it's not really Luffy's fault. Uh, I think Oda definitely had some development for him as well as some of the other Straw Hats. Mm -hmm. um, he had some developments mid-story, and then all of a sudden, some drastic change happened. Or maybe he started. He said that he just needed to focus maybe on this more on the story and the world, and just didn't have enough time to focus more on the characters. So I felt like at some point the characters started to go back to their original states. So it's really weird. It's because it, you see an evolution. You see an evolution him during you know Romance Dawn, during Hour Long Park, especially during Alabasta and Jaya. You know where uh, and Alabasta he says. To Vivi, that you know, you know, you can't save anyone. You can't save every single person. You can't prevent people from dying. And then yes. Jaya, you know, so, you know, saying that, look, Zoro, don't don't hit these guys back. And, you know, taking taking a cue from uh, Shanks. Yes. And then you're like, oh my god, like you know, he's starting to grow and stuff. And then it just he, from their point on, it sort of just devolves back into the original Luffy. It seems like he's just back to the guy who picks his nose and just says, it's, it's really weird the way it works. I feel, like, I feel like he understands what he needs to do. Like, he understands, like, after the situation with Marine Ford and Ace, he understood that it was not really his personality, but his strength, yo. He really wants, he was really frustrated on becoming stronger so he had, he could protect his crew, yo. And no, 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 that's sad. Uh, you're right, you're right. Yeah, so, like, with his development and his growth, yo, he, he didn't really frustrate on that because he, the way he, like, example of Marine Ford, yo, if, if he didn't have that personality in Marine Ford, yo, this, they wouldn't even come close to saving AC. Yo. So him having that personality is actually a positive and didn't need to be changed. It was more of him becoming more stronger and becoming more able to protect his people that are close to him. Yeah, no, definitely. Uh, that, that's a good point because during Marine Ford, that was a big lesson, you know, yeah, is so. that your strength comes from your people you just surround you as well as your own strength. But you can only get so far by yourself. You know, you, you can't just that's depend true. on yourself and... And Luffy was so focused on saving Ace that he sort of forgot about his crewmates who, who were still waiting for him and stuff. So mm -hmm. it's like a, it's like a roller coaster when it comes to Luffy's development. And it goes up and down and up and down. Mm -hmm. New World definitely felt like everyone's development went back. Um, mm -hmm. It feels like, you know, Usama all of a sudden was like, you know, like this cool guy. And all of a sudden he's like, oh, never mind. He just, he's still a that, security cat. That, that is true. Usopp, and, yeah. Usopp, Usopp, like, he came out, of, after I seen him in the barrio with Chilling with Nami, I thought this I was guy was Yes, <laughs> he was a new man. <laughs> yeah, outside for Luffy too, man, taking, you know, one shot in the path of East and everything, so. Too slow. That it's was like, slow. do I wish that Oda would, would go back to what he was doing, you know, like, in the first half of the story? I definitely do. And I hope, you know, I still, I'm still, you know, hoping that there's some chance for that. Um, but at the end of the day, uh, 
to be honest, you know, One Piece, I just watch it for the amazing storytelling, top level world building and foreshadowing. Mm -hmm. uh, characters, you know, they, they, they're not the best. They, they, I don't think they'll ever be anywhere near the, the best, but um, they're, they're but you said they're, 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 person, they're, they're sort of what defines them is not bad. Like, mm -hmm. it's, it, like you said, it, it attracts mm -hmm. people to it. Mm -hmm. And at the end of the day, that's all he really needs to worry about, I guess. Um, it, would it be nice for him to, to, to you know, develop a bit more? Yes, but yes. I don't know. I, I'll say this, that end of story Luffy, I really want to see something different in the story Luffy. Like. Oh, for sure. Yes. Uh, end the story. I think every single person has been like, just wanting something like that you know they're, they're all yes. wondering like what is luffy what's gonna zoro gonna be like what's sanji yes. gonna be like and because like, yeah, just you know, so much time passes you feel like something you know you don't want it to be pokemon or it's like yeah you know it <laughs> stays the same age all the entire time it doesn't doesn't grow any so most definitely you don't want a pokemon situation and with luffy like at, at the end of story i feel like he's gonna know more he's right now he's, he doesn't really want to know more like Situation like imagine remember when Jimby was talking about like things in the new world and he's like I don't care man I'll deal with it later yo. At the end of the story I feel like movie's gonna know every single situation that's going on and that's what's gonna make him change you. So I'm yeah. really excited. Yeah, so we're sort of we're, that would remind me sort of about Naruto. You know, Naruto, now that we've seen Naruto end, uh, we had the ability to see Naruto at the beginning of the series and Naruto at the end of the series with the whole Boruto stuff. Yeah. And yeah. you just see just how much mature Naruto is at the end of the series, uh, having having to take care of uh, a family. And growing, you know, raising a kid with the Boruto movie, it it it, it really was nice and refreshing. You know, seeing this kid that you know you saw the beginning of the series, yeah, and he grew up. He actually did grow up. So now, like, I want to see that with Luffy, man. <laughs> I want to see that with Luffy. So well, all we can do is hope and wait. Yeah, hope and wait. So uh, I guess if I had to, you know, sum it up, is Oda, is Oda capable of of you know some good character development? I think he is, mm -hmm. uh, but. For some reason, I think that he he just decided to focus on other aspects like the story and the and the, and the world building. Mm -hmm. I mean, this guy like barely gets any sleep, so it won't surprise me if he just doesn't have the time. Yeah, see, the their Oda has perfected other things. They are exactly. built up their array of characters, the world building, the adventures. I mean, yeah, the character pool in One Piece yeah. is ridiculous. Yes, and he, and he constantly just get the you know pulls from the the character pool. Uh, it's, in his chapters so it's interesting because like most series like if they had that much characters i wouldn't remember them but like for one piece it's different i remember so many characters that i shouldn't be remembering exactly which, and i was yes. talking about, actually talking to my friend about that the other day mm -hmm. uh and and i was just thinking because he, he watched a different series where you know some of the characters uh he, he didn't recognize and then i was like you know i was thinking when one piece has so many of these characters but they just come back all the time and they all play an important role so yeah. they all have something about them that's but like makes you remember them but yeah i'll put i'll put exactly like you said like he He's decided to, to focus on other aspects yes. of, of the series. And, you know, for, like I said, he barely sleeps. So yes. I mean, he, he, I'm sure he'd, he'd love to have character development, probably doesn't have any time for that.